Oh, hey, baby. What's going on? Uh, oh, yeah, you can sit next to me. Uh, come here. Oh, uh, I'm just reading through one of my spell books. You know, I gotta keep my memory up to date with everything. <laughs> No, no, getting the hand gestures down isn't the most important thing. I mean, don't get me wrong, they do play a role. I, I, I mean, why else would I be studying up? It, but what really matters is, the, you know, the, the passion and the, the soul. That kind of stuff, you know, all that when you put it into your spells. <laughs> oh, come on. Yes, I do know that magic confuses you, but I don't know, I I find it cute that you try to understand. I, I, I mean, uh, sorry, but I, I'm telling you though, I, I could teach you if you want. You'll let it be my thing for now? All right, I mean, if you say so, but I understand. But, um, anyways, was there a particular reason you wanted to, I don't know, come sit with me? No, 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 there, there doesn't have to be a reason, but, well, usually when you want to be around me, you don't ask, you just kind of, show up, and I get smushed. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh, oh. There, there is a reason. Um, well, I is something wrong? Uh, are you sure? No, no, I, 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 I'm, I'm not doubting you, I just wanted to be certain. If everything's okay, then what did you want to talk to me about? You want... what? What was that? Sweetheart, I can't hear you when you mumble. What did you want? You... you want to be more vulnerable around me? Huh? Like... You, you want to drop your guard and share more personal things with me? <laughs> I mean, a am I understanding that correctly? Yeah, I am? Well, I mean, of course you can, baby. Like, th that that's kind of... That's how a relationship is, you know? Uh, yeah, I, I don't mind. I mean... Listen, we're boyfriends, and, well, that means we can be vulnerable with each other. I, I mean, I I've told you some stuff that I I'd never share with anyone else, and it would be unfair of me to say that y you could not do the same. Huh? Uh, baby, what do you mean that you can't? Did I do something wrong? Wait, please, if I I, I, I I did something to break your trust, please, tell me. Whatever it is I've done, I, I'm sorry, it's just... It's... It, it's not me? Well, that is relieving. But... You say that you can't tell me. I, I, I guess I'm just a bit confused on that. But you do know that you don't have to tell me anything, right? Like, well, let me think. The best way I can put it is that I don't want to pressure you into thinking that you have to just because we're dating. I mean... Just because we are, it doesn't mean that we have to share literally everything with each other. It, it, it's not that? Well, well then what is it? 
So you do want to be vulnerable with me, but you don't know how? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I, I totally get that, baby. Trust me, it's never easy to share something personal with someone. I mean, even if you do trust them, it's still hard. <laughs> yeah, I, I understand. Like, you know my friend Alex? He's my best friend, and I, I don't think badly of him in any way, but I was still nervous when I told him that I practiced magic. Actually, terrified might have been the right word. I, I, I was so afraid that he would never want to talk to me again. But I, 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 I eventually worked up the courage, and the first thing he said to me after I told him was, That's awesome. <laughs> Just show me a trick. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't expect he'd treat me like that. But I guess what I'm trying to say is that I understand being scared to share your feelings. And whenever you are ready, I promise that I won't see you any less because of it. Sweetheart, d did I say something wrong? You got, like, so quiet all of a sudden. I, I didn't? Well, um, may I ask, what is, what's on your mind? Oh, you're ready to tell me, but you're too afraid to. Oh, I think I have something for that, actually. Um, one second. Let me get my... I, I got it. <laughs> Here. Sweetie, I, with your consent, and only with your consent, I can cast a spell that will help you get into a... Um, vulnerable headspace, let's say. Yeah, I, I know you still get a little nervous when I cast magic around you, which is why I wanted to ask for your permission first. I, I, I'm never going to and will never force you to say yes, but I do think it might help. You will? Oh, I'm so proud of you, baby. I, I promise this is just what you need. Now, come on, come on. Sit on my lap. Yes, yes, I know you are taller than me, but I need you to do this for the spell to work. Now, come on. I'm not going to bite. <laughs> Good boy. Now, just hold still and take some deep breaths while I work my magic. Uh, are you ready, sweetheart? All right, I'm going to cast it now. Sweetheart! Sweetheart! S sweet... S oh! Hi, sweetie! How are you? Whoa, 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 whoa! Calm down, sweetie! Calm down! Hey, hey! Shh! That's it, that's it. That's it. Just take deep breaths. You're doing so well for me. Good job, baby. What did I do? Well, I, I shrunk you. I mean, although you are a bit smaller than I had anticipated, I've got to practice this spell a bit more, I have to admit. I mean, it, it's always easier to shrink inanimate objects than living creatures. Um, wait, wait, sweetie, C calm down. Calm down. 
this is to help you feel vulnerable after all. I mean, look, you're basically the size of my finger. You practically have no choice but to be vulnerable. Don't worry, you are not in danger. Your big, strong, himbo husband is here. Yay! You don't look it thrilled. <laughs> I promise I'm going to keep you safe. <laughs> There's your smile. That's it. You're so much calmer now. I know that a sudden shift like this can be disorienting, but I, I promise I will protect you. Here, climb into my hand. Don't worry, baby. I, I promise I won't drop you. There you are. You're being so brave for me. Now I'm just going to lift you up slowly and hold you right here. Can you hear my heartbeat? Oh, you can feel it too? <laughs> well, I suppose you do get a nice massage to go along with it. It's nice and calming, isn't it? Like a, a gentle lullaby to help you relax. Go ahead and nuzzle into me. I don't mind. In fact, I think cuddles like this will help you feel so much better. So vulnerable and yet so safe. Nothing can hurt you while I'm holding you in my hands. I love you so much, baby. If, if there's anything I can do to help you feel protected, I will do it. And whenever you're ready, you can tell me exactly what you want to tell me. You can share or, or withhold as much as you want. And when you're done, just let me know and I'll get you back to your normal size. Don't thank me, sweetie. I'm doing this because I love you. And I want you to feel safe enough to share whatever it is on your mind. <laughs> oh my god, you're so cute like this. I, I mean, you're, you're cute normally, but... Uh, uh, now you're absolutely adorable. Can I give you a kiss? <laughs> well, <laughs> all right. Um, let me think about how it is the best to do this. Um, uh, I think it would probably just be best to give you a little peck on the top of your head. Well, little for me, but giant for you. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Aww, that expression of yours is the most precious thing. I know I call you baby a lot, but at this size, you're practically my actual baby. Cute enough to be one, too. <laughs> okay, I'll stop teasing. We'll snuggle again. You know, I think I like being the tall one for once. Maybe when I grow you back, I'll keep just a tiny bit of your height. <laughs> oh, come on. Wouldn't it be so perfect to have a husband taller than you? <laughs> oh, don't worry. As I said before, I will never do anything to you without your consent. Now, do you want to keep talking, or do you feel ready to share how you feel? You just want a bit more time? 
Uh, okay. Cuddles are just as good as any other type. I love you too, sweetie. Now remember, you are safe with me. And you can tell me anything you want. And I will not judge you. Whenever you're ready, I'm all ears.